Alright, we're checking out the only game where you can literally draw unbridled terror and somehow still win. It's Scribble Rider. This is one of the few times in my life when I can draw the state of Florida and it becomes the tires of my vehicle that my character will now use to try and complete a board to get more money, to get better ink and stuff. Now, some may call it the state of Florida on the wheels. More than, it's kind of more looks like a boomerang, but whatever. You can see I'm slowly upgrading to a better motorcycle. And by better motorcycle, I mean something made in third grade wood shop. Okay, how come Nicole has an amazing motorcycle? So what happens if you just like take up the entire area? Just like one giant block. Can you do that? Is that fine? Yeah, you can. Okay, so you get squares and they went with the fortune cookie look. Uh-huh. So what's better? Just simplistic squares or fortune cookies? Okay, gigantic squares are amazing. I'm kind of curious what sort of like deadly objects they try and put you on. Is that a sad rain cloud that Nicole has to endure for losing? I love how this game doesn't pull any punches. It's like you fail terribly. You have no redeeming qualities. Cry on your motorcycle while you get rained on. Now there's a shop over here too. I'm kind of curious what I have to do to get different wheels. Do I need to buy these? What is this wheel? It looks like a missile. I like how it goes from, you know, motorcycle to llama to, is that a steer? It looks like a steer, you know, like a, uh, like a bull. I mean, we're going to lose, but I need to know. Can I just do like one line? Yeah, like that. That's all. <laughs> That's the tire. <laughs> oh God. I can't believe I managed to get one foot up. She's crying. Yeah, you should be crying after what I made. Do you have to go through the water? Um, can I do the word kill? Hey. I L L. There we go. All right, Jeremy, you better live in fear because at this point, I'm not just beating you with images. I'm beating you with scripted words. Wow. The word kill is incredibly fast, but not really that great inside of the water. I have a feeling that maybe when we climb, I might catch up a little bit because right now I'm doing absolutely terrible. Come on, kill, kill, kill. Oh, kill is fantastic at climbing. Kill was made to climb. Push it down and then onto all the iPhone cases. Kill has taken the lead. I just realized too that Jenny, the person I was up against, she's what? been skinned alive. I don't really remember if she had skin coming into this battle or not. <laughs> oh yeah, give me the wood shop bike, baby. Oh, and I unlocked a new person. I'm unlocking everything. Okay, so I can unlock the wooden tires or the wooden bike. They're both terrible. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of want the wooden bike. Blast opponent? If you die, just know this wasn't my fault. It was for science. So what do I want to draw here? I'm gonna draw a pistol. Here we go. There's the little finger area and there's the handle and we'll go ahead and fill that in because I don't have any limitation to how much I'm allowed to draw apparently. There we go. That is a pretty decent gun right there. She is going with the nacho tire. Then for some reason, whoa, she's back. How did she draw brain? Oh, you can change? I had no idea. I didn't know that you could change. This game just got 100 million times better. Go, no. She just went into sat. She just left the entire stratosphere. She's gone. She's dead. I don't know where she went, but she's not coming back, people. She went into space. I won. I'm the winner by a lot. Ooh, now I can buy the real motorcycle. All right, now it's it's wood shop bike versus wood shop bike. But I get I, now that I know I can draw as much as I want, we are going to start with the mighty yeet. If if I if I know how powerful a yeet is, I may not even have to change it. Well, the 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 T is going to have to be slightly malnourished. See that right there? Kind of like a malnourished T. And then she's going to go with Is those are those tentacles? Ah! Ah, who can climb better? The yeet is the climber of the century. All right, let's go with something that rolls a little bit better. Perfect. Yay. And my my wild vomitous Twizzlers ended up beating Amy's weird octopus tentacles. I kind of want those octopus tentacles. I'm not going to lie. Oh, it's a die. What does it do? Mystery prize. Okay. I got four. Four what? Four chunks? Oh, it's four chunks. Okay, so now I have to go up an ice slide. So, hold on. So, can I just draw... Can I draw, like, a really spiky tire? It basically looks like one of those things that you step on in the summer and it gets jammed inside of your foot. There. How about that? Ultra spiky tires. Go. Are his wheels, like, a, a bunch of fish? What is that? It's like a bunch of chicken wings or something. Okay. Oh, his chicken wing fell off. Oh, he's trying to change them. So, now in the water, let's do, like, a pack. Paddle. The paddle is the way to go. And then he's moving over to, wow, I don't know what he moved over to, but he gained probably like an extra 30 feet and almost ended up winning. Glucy, like Gary Busey, the off-brand version. How come they're all American? I'm up against a, a hot dog. I 
It's not a person. What is this? Is this a giant climbing thing? So can I draw like a dead stick figure? Like right here, there's the feet. And over here is kind of like the pool of blood right there. Is that okay? How's a, how's a dead stick figure work? Is it gonna work okay? I'm still very curious as to try and find out. Oh, it is a trampoline. And then you have to climb. You just have to straight up climb. And you have to murder this random bird. I don't know why. Wow, the height. Okay. And then I'm just gonna move into something much smaller. So, okay, so for some reason, the smaller the tire and the simpler, the faster it is on plane land. And then when you're climbing something, you want a thing that looks vaguely like a Twinkie that's been blown blown up by a small stick of dynamite. Am I unlocking a hot dog? Oh, I think it's a bread. Oh, I love carbs. Oh, diabetes wheels. All right, cult, get ready because you're about to get beaten by an opened can of Bud Light beer. I'm gonna stretch out, put my hands on the handlebars, not like that really does anything. And we're gonna have to climb these stairs. Okay, Bud Light is incredible at climbing stairs. Like nachos are pretty good too, but I don't even think I'm gonna have to change the Bud Light. Bud Light, big jump off of the trampoline, tons of air. How does Bud Light do in the water? water. Bud Light is fairly fast. It definitely keeps a lot of your- uh oh, hold on. I need- I need something bigger. I was about to say, I'm gonna have to murder this flamingo up over the edge. Bud Light brought me way to the end, and then it almost gave up the win. At that last second, the elephant trunk came out of nowhere and stole the victory. Give me my bread. Oh, carb tires. Where have you been all my life? Oh, yeah, it almost looks like stuffed crust pizza. We're drawing a giant C for carbs. All right, carbs. We got some we got everything here. We got to knock over this this random block. Oh, never mind. We're oh, it is burning my it's burning my little <laughs> my little baguettes down. Oh no, this is so hard to climb over. Let me get something a little bit more claw like. Something like this. Oh, it's a it's a aerobatic like in the air type of thing. That's interesting. The baguettes. No, right at the last second, they lost. Okay, at this point, I have enough for a real motorcycle. There. Although I kind of wish there was like a legitimate bread motorcycle. I would just have, oh, wow, okay. I'm gonna do an F. You always wanted the Fs in chat, now you have them. She has an O, so F-O. I don't know what the rest of this word could possibly be. Let's see how good the Fs are climbing up the wall. Uh, they're okay. It looked like a circle is actually better. Oh, wow, now I'm climbing up a, what is this? It's like a mountain climbing board. Come on, baby. Yeah, claw your way up there. Excellent. Uh, perfect circle. It's not even close to a perfect circle. Slightly better circle. Oh, this circle is fast. This circle is fast. Yeah, it was like a photo ending, but we got it over Larissa. I've been racing for so long, my skin has melted off my body and has been replaced with a cybernetic exoskeleton. Also, what am I? Am I just climbing over a hill? Like, it's just rock. <laughs> so, I don't know, like a star? There we go. It's like something straight out of Mario Brothers. There we go. Is that the invincibility star? Let's see how that works. Okay, they're going with like a slingshot over there or something. So, the invincibility star is doing okay. Oh, wow. You legitimately have to climb up an entire mountain. So invincibility star still working out. Oh, this is completely eluding my opponent. She has no idea what to do. I am now laughing in her face as I finish the board. She wasn't even close. Oh yeah, going with the spank master paddles. Now you may notice that for some reason there is now a hot dog next to me instead of the original guy that was there. That was because the game just suddenly decided it like wanted to do. Oh my God. <laughs> the game decided it suddenly didn't want to exist anymore. <gasps> I have to have it. I always wanted the insane cow. I kind of want the, I don't know what to call those wheels he has. It kind of looks like Oreo cookie wheels or something. It's like high calorie wheels. I want those to try this. This should do fairly well at climbing the wall. I would think you want something that's not too wide. Oh, wow. The C's are way better at doing the, whoa, you ain't going to burn off my carbs. You need more calorie burning exercises than that, Niaz. I now have the a cow mobile. I almost have it. I need 100 coins, apparently. It costs 100 coins to get this cow and put it on some loaves of bread. I have no idea what this is. Some sort of breakable wall or something? In case you're wondering what I'm drawing, this is supposed to be a turkey, if you can imagine that. Like, there's a little turkey body. There's one little turkey leg right there. There's the nose, like the beak. There's the other sad turkey leg. Kind of a turkey if the turkey had a very underdeveloped torso, I would suppose. How good is a turkey at doing its thing? Uh, you know, turkeys can 
climb, apparently. That's not bad. That flamingo's looking at my turkey, and it's like, I don't know what you were trying to do, Gray, at all. Okay. Oh, the turkey can swim. Oh, the turkey is incredible at swimming. Okay, the other thing is swimming a lot, lot better than my turkey. Come on, rotate faster. Rotate faster. Come on, baby. Go, 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 go. We win it. We get there. Fraud. It's kind of like, it's kind of like Fred. Only you decided to use a completely different vowel, and so your name is really weird. Whoa. Okay, so <laughs> this weird tesseract over here. I don't even know what to say about this. So do you have to push this? Are you supposed to climb it? Yeah, you're supposed to climb this somehow. All right, how about like much smaller? Maybe you are supposed to push it. I have no idea. Climbing this is almost impossible. Oh, I'm getting there. I'm legitimately getting there. Come on, baby. Come on. You can do it. Yes, he's slipping back down. Well, sounds kind of bad because effectively he's like drowning alive and I'm laughing about it. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! Drown! If it means I get to win, it's fine. Also, now I can have my cow. Oh, we, we graduated to penguin land. Okay, sure. These penguins wearing little pie crusts on their heads. I think they're hard hats, but I really want it to be pie crusts. All right, so how about if I draw the coin shape that this board has? It's kind of the coin shape, okay? <laughs> it, it could it could have been a lot better, I get it. Oh, that just slides awfully down all this. I need more jaggedness. There we go. That's the kind of jaggedness I need. Perfect. Yeah, excellent climbing tires, especially since we have to go through even more ice. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's perfect. And now we're going to do the big paddles like this. Okay, that paddle is not doing anything. Those are much better paddles. That is fantastic paddles. I just kind of made like a, a slight mountainous Bob Ross-ish background squiggle and it turned out to be great. Oh, it is all ice all the time. And then do we have to climb the ice? I'm up against brr. I want to try the squiggles one more time. I feel like the squiggles can really come into their own here. So we're going to do the big jump. Then we have to climb with the infinite squiggles. And it looked like the square is a bit more. Hold on. Let me, I'm going to try. I'm going to I'm going to cheat this. I'm going to do the square as well because the square looked to go up these walls fantastically. I'm basically just taking it from this other person. And then last moment, now we'll put the big squiggles in. It kind of looks like I'm driving a snowmobile, if you will, like the giant skis in the front. I do love the name though. Give me the llama. Give me the llama. I've got the llama. Right now, I just need enough money for it. I need 100 coins for the llama. I will gladly accept a llama before a pencil. We're going with the L. L for llama. Go. Okay, his, he kind of had an L as well. Kind of weird. We, we both we both had the same idea. Oh, yeah, I'm just slapping all of these banana. Wow, where did you get all that speed from? Okay, get up the stairs. Get, oh, never mind. You know what? I I thought this was going to be a lot closer than it was, but it ended up not being close at all. Now we're just floating softly, floating softly to the end. Where did my opponent go? Did my opponent just drown alive? Now I have to ricochet off a giant beach ball? Uh, how about if I just draw a hand? Here's a thumb and here's four terribly drawn fingers. Kind of kind of looks more like a cauliflower than a hand, but I mean, we'll see how the hand performs. Oh my God, the hand is performing admirably. The hand is incredible. The hand is starting to get caught up kind of fast, though. The hand is not as incredible anymore. Come on, hand. Climb the stairs. This is what you were made for. You're kind of disappointing me now. Hand! Oh, the hand! Yes, the hand! I don't... I can't believe it! <laughs> That's a lot of climbing, it looks like. Like a freakish amount of climbing. Like a totally inappropriate amount of climbing. There's a stick figure wildly vomiting. It could also be a stick figure breathing fire. I guess it just depends on what you prefer. Vomiting stick figure for the win. Vomit your way up the side of this delicious, like, off-colored graham cracker. Are you supposed to jump it? Whoa, full flip. Oh, oh, this is gonna be close. Stick figure. <laughs> this game literally has it out for me. <laughs> Please let me have the head of lettuce. I wanted to draw a goldfish. It came out like a, I don't know, like a, a demonic tadpole or something. I mean, it's, the tadpole is doing really well. Oh yeah, it's really, it's actually doing fantastic. She's going with the uh, the Dorito look again, and Doritos are powerful, don't get me wrong, they've done quite well. I'm trying the Dorito here as well. My Dorito has a lip on it though, which is pretty nice. So when it starts to like slip, it can catch. Plus if we're doing all these stairs, the lip of the Dorito should do really well. Oh, I got a power boost out of nowhere and that gave me a tremendous amount of speed. Lip Dorito. All right, there's my, whatever this is, like vegan tires. This is it. My last board up against Larissa. Is that a titanic singing penguin with a crown playing a massive piano? That is incredible. We're gonna go with G S P. 
Gray still plays. Vegetables versus sugar. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'd rather have the sugar, but GSP is incredible. Oh yeah. I I am really outperforming anything that I thought I would ever be able to do. I'm not gonna lie. I'm good at swimming too, which is true. I am fairly good at swimming, mostly because I'm surrounded by water and all sides down here in Florida. And if I wasn't, I'd be dead. GSP lived the competition in the dust. Yes, we have a winner. Well, I guess the answer is yeah. Eat your vegetables, kids. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Scribble Rider. Till next time, stay foxy, much love.